How would you assess the overall energy of the team tonight? Tonight, uh, I'm going to be honest, it was bad energy. We got outplayed by everyone on the team, every single one of us. Hey, would you attribute that to anything? Was it just one of those nights? How do, you, how do you look at a night like this? I think it was just one of those nights we came in unprepared. We just got to be better than this. Jared, what makes covering Larry Mar Markkinen so tough? Uh, amazing player all around, shooting-wise, driving-wise, and finishing at the rim. So you really have to guard him on all facets of the game. Jared, what's the most uh, it's amazing seeing him back out there. You know, he's coming back to his old self. He's still not totally there, but you saw glimpses of it tonight. Did it feel any different with him out there on the floor? Uh, it didn't feel like old cares. You know, that's, that's not how he's going to be yet. But when he gets back to himself, he will be. <laughs> it's surprising that he looked as spry as he did even after three no. months out. I was, I'm going to give a lot of credit to our training staff. They bring us along the right way. They make sure we're healthy and make sure we're completely ready for the game. Is it encouraging to see him take all the contact at the rim like he did in the fourth quarter and play right through it? Uh, it's encouraging that he's, saying, uh, he's still going up with a lot of confidence. He's not letting the injury hold him back. Would you say this is somewhat of a humbling loss after, you know, you beat a tough team like Denver and then you play a 12-win team like Chicago? And uh, it showed uh, what we had 32 assists uh, against Denver, and then, I don't know, it just didn't seem like we had a lot tonight. So it just shows that we still have to bring the same type of energy every night against any team.